Hello, this is another little tutorial for flight gear, for flight gear users. Um, today we will look at alternative ways to get your scenery for flight gear. Um, you can also, oh, the world is your oyster with flight gear, you can fly the world, you have to download it though. There is a function in flight gear called uh, TerraSync, which will download things as you fly, but it's for some people it's not fast enough it really depends on your location and connection to the master server blah 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 blah. so some people it can work perfectly fine some people it can't for those who can't there's this little tool here it's called TerraMaster the link to download this tool will be in the video description at the bottom it's written in Java so it's pretty cross-platform compatible uh, it basically gives you the world map and you can highlight the individual terrain tiles you want to download or swathes of them or continents if you wish um, it also it downloads that to your TerraSync directory which you need to set up on your options screen click in there as you set your terrain, yeah, TerraSync folder. You can find your TerraSync folder from your launcher, right, from your flight gear launcher. There should be a little screen pop up in a second with it highlighted, and that tells you where your TerraSync directory is on your particular machine, and you just set it to the same. You download the scenery where you want to go, it downloads, when the download is complete, the next time you run your flight gear, that scenery is available to you. So let's have a look. This is the basic map. You can also do it in global file, changing the mode, like so. And you can scroll it round about. So let's just pick a little bit of landmass. Let's zoom in on these islands here. So I wanted to download this little chain of islands. Click, highlight, drag across them. Those are the ter terrain tiles that will be downloaded. Hit the synchronize button and Bob's your uncle. That's it, downloading. Progress bar gives you a status. Don't be much here. So that's it, downloading away from the master server. It's the same ser the same terrain data as you get through TerraSync. Um, while that's doing that, if we look at the map, these are areas that I have, you've got downloaded. These are areas I've got downloaded that are green. The ones highlighted in yellow that is detected, there's a difference between when I downloaded it till now. those yellow tiles you may want to download again if you have any. Um, a little notice is when you run this little program the more data the more terrain data you have in your folder the longer it will, it will take to boot up because it has to check everything as it starts. Uh, so if you've got a lot of stuff downloaded it will take a little while before the program actually runs up and is ready to use. You may think it's not booting but it, it well, it might take in up to half an hour, depending on how long and how much scenery you have. Pretty straightforward. Yeah, my scenery is still downloading. Progress bar is at 9%. It's not all that quick, but uh, if you don't have any luck with TerraSync, this is the alternative way to do it. And you can pick and choose where you want and have it ready to fly before you get there. Simple. That's basically it, how it works. Check the link at the bottom of uh, the video description for the link to download the little TerraMaster tool.